Hey, what's up, guys? It's Kieran Akensei back with episode 11 of Adventures in Skyrim. Um, for those who watched the last video, you know that I died. <laughs> well, Wolfgar died as he faced the troll. So, yeah. So we've gone back to the same point, and hopefully things will be a bit different this time. We'll have to wait and find out. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, guys. Leave a like, leave a comment. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter or Twitch, depending on what you watch. And I hope you enjoy the video. I'll catch you guys on the other side. See you in a bit. Oh, this weather is freezing. Let's be careful. Never know what's around the corner. I hear something. Troll. Uh, come on! back. Both of them might be useful. Let's keep on the path. We can't be that far from High Hrothgar now. Oh. Get out of this cold. You oh. here is beautiful. Let's not linger in it though. The cold will take our toe my toes before long. <laughs> uh. Hopefully these greybeards can tell me what it is that I need to know. I do hope so. What does it mean to be a dragonborn? Dovahkiin. Don't know what to make it all. Some legend, maybe? Why me? To Red Guard. Can I possibly accomplish by myself? Ah, uh, this looks like it. I Hrothgar. Impressive place. The door's open. Ah, good. <sighs> Self respectable for the Greybeards. with them. So, Greetings. A dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age. You call me dragonborn. But what what does that mean? I've never heard this term before. First, let us see if you truly are dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. My voice? I don't know what you mean. Shout at us and let us taste of your voice. Shout? Um... 
Havate! Strike us with the power of your voice. I guess that's not what he meant. Um, maybe if I focus on the dragon power. Do not be afraid. Fuss! Whoa. It is you. Welcome what was to that? Hrothgar. I am Master Angir. I speak for the Greybeards. Now, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? Greetings to you, Master Angir. My name is Wolfgar. I come from Storse Mackay. I want to know what it means to be Dragonborn. I've never heard of this term in my homeland, and I'm curious of what it means. We are here to guide you in that pursuit, just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the Dragonblood that came before you. I see. You mean, I'm not the first Dragonborn then? Or the only one? You are not the first. There have been many of the Dragonblood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift upon mortal kind. Whether you are the only Dragonborn of this age, that is not ours to know. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. That is all I can say. See. Then, I'm here to answer your summons, Master Angir of the Greybeards. We are honored to welcome a Dragonborn to High Hrothgar. We will do our best to teach you how to use your gift in fulfillment of your destiny. What... what is my destiny then? That is for you to discover. We I can see. show you the way, but not your destination. Then... Teach me, Master Angir of the Greybeards. I, Wolfgar, am ready to learn. You have shown that you are Dragonborn. You have the inborn gift. But, do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? Uh, that remains to be seen. Without training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thum, a shout. See. Now let us see if you are willing and able to learn. I will certainly try. Language of dragons. Thus, your dragon blood gives you an inborn ability to learn words of power. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. See. Master Einarth will now teach you Ro, the second word in unrelenting Ro. force. Ro means balance in the dragon tongue. Combine it with Fus. Force to focus your thumb more sharply. I see. So I just look at it. Row. Row. I feel like I've learned it. Thank you, Master. Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. As part of your initiation, Master that's how I got the power. That's the power of the dragon I absorbed. Let's <sighs> uh, uh, uh. see. I do. Teach me. Use your unrelenting force shout to strike the targets as they appear. Understand. Oh, 
was wrong! Thank you, Master. You will perform your next trial in the courtyard. Follow Master Boy. Master Boy, of course. I feel empowered. Words of power. Shouts are mighty. Follow your lead, Master. At least it's dawn now. I think I got here when I did. Sun's up at least. So, oh, Master, what is my next test? You will now see how you learn a completely new shout. Of course. Master Bori will teach you wool. World. You must hear the word within yourself before you can project it into a thorn. World. World. <sighs> hear it. Okay, Master. Feel stronger. Okay. What's my test? Master Wolfgar will demonstrate whirlwind sprint. Wolfgar. <laughs> We share a name then, Master. Okay. will open the gate. Use your whirlwind sprint to pass through before it closes. Right. Wold. Wold. That could be useful. I hope I've impressed you, Master Angir. Your quick mastery of a new thum is uh, astonishing. I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself? I don't know how exactly I do it. It just happens. I just able to do it. It is an extraordinary power to, indeed. Given this gift by the gods for a reason, it is up to you to determine how best to use it. You are now ready for your last trial. My last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jurgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengrau. I see. Remain true to the way of the voice, and you will return. Thank you, Master. I do have a few questions. If you don't mind. Why are dragons returning to Skyrim? Does it have something to do with me, the Dragonborn? No doubt the appearance of a Dragonborn at this time is not an accident. Your destiny is surely 
bound up with the return of the dragons. You should focus on honing your voice, and soon your path will be made clear. I understand. Thank you, Master. I will continue my training. Good. Then you will be ready for whatever lies ahead. Thank you. Sky, I will take you my leave then. To Jorgen Winkhaller. Right. Let's make sure we have some food before we leave. May I use the facilities, Master? I'll take that as a yes. I'll just um, use a corner. That's all I need. Just to eat and recuperate from the climb. <sighs> right. Let's eat. That's the Valthen Towers I did. <laughs> I have some bits to sell. I'll find a shop soon. <sighs> Two. <sighs> Make our way to like it's near Morthal. Huh. Looks like I have to go back the way I came. Hmm. Let's see. The path looks like it takes me close to Dr Whiterun again. If I go to Whiterun. Get the carrot. Take the carrot from there. To Morthal, there's just a short walk. Well, look. That's the plan. Okay. Make our way down a mountain. Climb down, and then we need to make our way to White White Run. I suppose now's a good time to keep testing this new powers of mine. Ah, oh. see that on the way in. Like, Lord, hmm. Let's give this a try, shall we? That could come in very handy. I need to cross the gap. We mean an enemy. <sighs> Make our way down quickly. Find Strider. Make our way to Morthal. Seems I am destined for great things here in Skyrim. I wonder if. That means redemption from my past. 
One can hope. As long as the elves don't find me here, I should be safe. Although with such a grand title as Doverkeen, they're probably bound to find me at some point. Bit of a good fight. Right, let's hurry. The sooner we get down the mountain, the sooner we can get to Whiterun. I had a funny feeling that I'd be taking this, these steps a lot. Uh. Surely they could have some sort of magic that could transport me somewhere quickly. I think the dragons would have such a thing. At least the day is bright, for now. But cold while on the mountain. We can't be far from the bottom now. This looks vaguely familiar. Let's just keep going. Ah yes, not far now, that's that saber cat I killed earlier. There's a path, is the path I took? Oh yes it is. I was going to head straight down the side of the mountain then. That would have been silly. Fine Strider. Ah. There's Iris dead. There we can. Make our way back to Whiterun. Hopefully Stride is still there. That means at least we can make our way to White Run. Getting a bit warm now. Let's take my helmet off for now. I might leave the helmet somewhere behind. It gets a bit cumbersome sometimes. I have to take it off and on. go. Now, where did I leave you, Strider? Ah, there you are, boy. You there. Hello? You're the one they call Dragonborn. That's not what they... That's what the Greybeards seem to think, though. Not sure about everybody else. Then it is too late. The lie has already taken root in the hearts of men. What? So we shall expose to them the falseness in their hearts. By tearing out yours. To what? Suffer. When Lord Mirak appears, all shall bear witness. None shall stand to oppose him. You want to fight? Come on. Where are you? Who are they? Take the hawk feathers. Have a look. Board the vessel Northern Maiden docked at Raven Rock. 
Victor to Windhelm, then begin to kill the false dragonborn known as Wolfgar before he reaches Solstheim. There's that name again, Mirak. I'll take that for later. Dagger might be worth something. Now, where's your compatriot? Have a look, see what's on her. I wonder who this Mirak is then. And I've lost Ryder. Great. Ryder! Ryder! What are you doing, you silly horse? It doesn't have a piece of that nern root. That. Come on, Strider. Let's get out of the water. We have to travel to Whiterun. Off we go again. The long journey once more. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave a like, please comment, please subscribe. Follow me on Twitter, follow me on Twitch. And I will see you next time, guys. This is Kurono Kensei. And we are out.